The German government has organized a four-day capacity building training for the Michiko local government legislative arm in Adamawa State, aiming to enhance social cohesion through community development planning and monitoring. The Michiko local government in Adamawa State, one of seven affected by Boko Haram insurgents in 2013, is partnering with Germany's Ministry for Economic Cooperation and Development. The Christian Rural and Urban Development Association of Nigeria and the Center for Public Education and Mobilization for Development in Nigeria. Also, is a development partner who has been assisting both in the monetary aspect uh, to the needs among the community who has mostly been affected by the uh, uh, insurgencies that took place some years back, let's say uh, 2015, uh, 16, and 17. And now the German government is assisting now uh, GIZ with a development plan that will help rebuild some of the destruction carried out by the insurgencies. Project coordinator Oxfam Enoch Bamayi outlined the project aim in strengthening social cohesion in Michika, targeting over 1,280 people across 16 words, leveraging citizen engagement for social and economic development. Uh, the project is aimed at improving cities, uh, social cohesion through community development planning approaches across 16 wards of Michika. Uh, as you are aware, Michika is one of the worst hit local governments in Adama State in terms of when, uh, during the insurgency attack. So one of the, uh, that is one of the reasons why Michika is selected as part of early recovery or an, a recovery effort from the attack of the Boko Haram insurgents in uh, Adama State. Yeah, and the project is actually leveraging on the citizens' engagement and participatory planning policy, which was recently passed by the Adama State government, geared at ensuring that development initiatives are guided and driven by community people by themselves. This program is, is actually a consultative um, uh, workshop and also a capacity building training for senior government officials in Michika on monitoring and evaluation. Uh, uh, monitoring and evaluation of this community development plan which was actually um, developed and uh, reviewed and also validated. So wh why we're here is that, okay, Michika Local Government has a plan, has a community development plan. How can they monitor it? How can they be able to track some of those um, uh, projects, some of those priority needs that they've identified? So that's why we're here. So two things. First is to have a consultative forum with key stakeholders to look at some of those indicators, look at some of those um, key areas that they need to track and monitor, and then also build the capacity of the managers of this framework. So we're developing a framework and we're also building the capacity of the managers of this framework. So that's why we're here. I will still go to my community, to my village, to enlighten them more about what I have learned here and to still encourage them that what, we are, what they are planning to bring to them is real. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.